What's up, everybody? My name is Lehua, and welcome to the Super Fina channel. I am a Hawaii variety content creator, host of podcasts across worlds, and I stream on twitch.tv slash Lehua Super Fina. Today, we are reacting to Higehiro, and if you like anime reactions, don't forget to subscribe, ring the bell so you can notify on the next upload, and if you like to support the channel, we got channel membership and Patreon. Links to those are below. We are reacting to Higehiro episode 10. Oh, it's official. Silo's going home. Dang. Okay. They're going home, or can we just see like different scenes with them separated? Whoa. Their parents are kind of dot 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 dot. <laughs> Ooh. He's unsure if the brother's on her side's side. I can see why. But I think the brother is on her side. I wonder if the brother feels a little responsible by how Sai is treated by her parents. Proof. The title of this episode is Proof. Oh, there's a brother. What up, bro? Would the brother be considered as a pretty guy? Let me know in the comments if he's considered pretty since a lot of the guys in this show look similar. Like, there's no distinct features of this one is very handsome, this one is ugly kind of thing. Yes, I is lucky for me and a man like him. She's super lucky after all the skeevy guys she's been with. Oh, interesting. Oh, he's telling the truth. Oh, he's, he's being so honest to brother. It's because she was cute. I don't know if a brother would like to hear that. I think that is a bad answer from a sibling's perspective. I wouldn't like... <laughs> I'd be like, were you looking at my sibling like that? How dare you? But considering how that has been with worse... And I think the brother has an idea. Like, the brother doesn't seem stupid. Oh! Oh, so Sai's already seen what a broken relationship looks like. Oh, and she already had father issues, I want to say. Oh, so he simply became proof. Oh. Yikes. Uh-huh, so I used it was completely normal. Because I was old enough to realize that the smile. Ooh, th that smile was gone. Parent like person? Do we want him to be a parent like person though? Or is the brother like creating a boundary? He's creating. Of that line. What does the brother do for a job anyways?
wants to. Did the brother really want to apologize? I think the brother was there to like give a talk. Okay, in this scene, he does look average compared to the brother. I wouldn't want to go to her home either. Her mom seems like the mom places anger onto her. Like, not only is that like proof that her husband doesn't love her, even if she has a kid, his child, Sayu is also kind of like she can be a punching bag. She could be, like, emotionally. Aww, look how detailed. Oh, I love seeing homemade cookbooks like that. Oh, it just makes you want to actually cook it. <laughs> I should know, I have tons of cookbooks already. <laughs> I used like one of them. Oh, brah, you're drinking a lot of coffee. I wonder if he was there all day. Is it nighttime? What if he stayed there overnight? I can't tell what time it is in there. Is it done on purpose? The time just flies by without you knowing? Oh, this is in the opening scene. Huh, <laughs> stars. I just watched the Sailor Moon Eternal movies. <laughs> Part one and two. Yeah, the thing about stars. The fact that she went all the way here will start will stay a part of her past. She ran really far, to be quite honest. I'm surprised her brother even found her. She's been gone for a long time. She was really far. Like, did her mom even try to look for her? Avoid facing her mistake. The reason why I picked up on avoiding her mistake is because she made a lot of mistakes after that. Oh, she wanted to leave while he wasn't there. While he was at work. She was going to try to leave. Oh, secret. Say goodbye. Thank you. Leave a letter behind. Oh, she's crying! 
Oh, another proof. Prove that her meeting him was a good thing in her life. I don't know, that just sounds like she's trying to validate her running away. If she didn't run away, she wouldn't have met him. And if she didn't meet him, she wouldn't have had this courage to confront her past. Her mistakes. Oh, she's scared. She doesn't want to go away, be apart from him. Oh, wow. She really depends on him emotionally, huh? Yeah, you never met her. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he'll definitely miss her. He'll definitely miss her, for sure. He'll be like a zombie at work. Eh? That's a little intrusive, right? What if she doesn't want him? What if Saif doesn't want Yoshida to see her Hokkaido life? I bet in her hometown, it's really bleak and... Depressing. Damn. That sweat drop. <laughs> he looks a little nervous. Oh ho ho, a phone call. What? What if she left already? Because she talked about how she was trying to leave while he was at work. Was she like giving him a hint that she was going to do that? I would assume that she went home already. But this whole setting is making it like she got kidnapped or she got into an accident. Good teamwork. <laughs> Really? You thought this would happen? Think about anything else? You mean like a romantic way or as like someone who's responsible for her? You're not being very specific. Is it pissing you off because he's frustrating you?
Bruh, he is just throwing him the truth. Oh, the tea here, the tea. Like, I can tell. I can tell you're my best friend. You're going through all this stuff. You're not confronting it. You're lying to yourself. You're not facing it. You are frustrating me, boy. I'm seeing you struggle when you could have just gone straight forward, but you're like holding yourself back. Oh, gosh. Ah, he even sees it, how Sai does depend on him. And how she is scared. They're not even, like, saying outright that she's scared. They're just saying that she's depending on him and how she doesn't want to go home alone. They're not even... saying that she's scared. They're just... Describing what what she's apprehensive about. What's making her emotions shake. Wait, 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 wait. She's at the workplace too, right? So, those two guys left. That co-worker was still at the office. She got there pretty fast. I'm making a face because I'm like, I, I see a flaw in this. Then her, she's the one who called him. Was this like a setup? Oh, this is the first time he's seen her. Okay, maybe this was just an opportunity for the friend to see Sayu. Okay. I can I can see the logic in this. Okay. Oh, look at that, the little blush line. What if he will do something, huh? But he won't. He's too responsible. She's like, scoot, scoot. Scoot, scoot. Shoot the big spoon? Are we doing... Are we spooning? Are we even going to see spooning? No, no, no spooning. No spooning. Oh! Do we did <gasps> spooning? Oh dear! And the sun's out. This relationship could go anywhere. It could go parental. It could go romantic. Uh... Like, I 
I always saw this being Iwasuka romantic, but this seems like the episode to establish where their relationship would go. Or it could just be platonic, and we'll never know. It will be ambiguous. No mention of brother, just dad. Is he that much older than her brother? <laughs> and that's my reaction to Higehiro episode 10. What do you think about that episode? What do you think about this video reaction? Let me know in the comments below. And if you want to talk outside of YouTube, there's a Discord. Discord link is available in the description. I also stream on twitch.tv slash Superfina. People who watch these videos, if you like to stop by the stream, have that one-on-one -on -one real time conversation about the anime, the episodes, about these videos. You guys are more than welcome. Outside of YouTube and Twitch, I host podcasts across worlds where we talk about anime, manga, and other things we're interested in. If you like podcasts like that, link to the podcast is in the description. We are available on all platforms. Other than that, my name is Lehua, and this is the Superfina channel reacting to Higehiro episode 10. Hope you guys like this video, and I will see you on the next one. Later! Huge thanks to my Patreons and channel members for making this video possible. If you also want to be part of the Superfina party, you can click over here or become a channel member. Don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss the next video. And I do stream live on Twitch every Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays. Hope to see you guys there and I will see you on the next video. This bump.